Hey everyone, um, I just wanted to remind you about some stuff on Schoology that will help you to share resources with, with one another. And just a warning before we get going, there is a 100% chance my kids are going to walk in on this recording. Hashtag work from home is amazing. Um, all right, so just so that you, just so a reminder on how to share with other teachers that may be teaching the same subject area that you are. That's what groups are for. Um, that gives you the chance to share resources back and forth. So I'm just going to kind of walk you through groups and how to create a group and what to do with groups and all of that kind of stuff. So this is groups right here. You can see my groups. Um, once you click on my groups, then you have the app option to create a group. So you can create a new group um, with just the teachers that you want um, to share lessons with. Um, so just hit create group. Um, then you can name it. I'm just going to call this COVID-19. <laughs> and um, you can decide if it's access to everybody or if it's invite only. You can also select a category for it. All these options are optional, though. Um, so it's kind of up to you what you want to do. Um, and then you can just go create. So now I have my COVID-19 group. From here, I can go to members and I can add um, different members to the group. Um, so I can add members just by searching for, um, say, Euclid High School, and I can search by name of whoever. Thanks, Josh, let me use your name. Um, then you can find the, your, the teacher that you want to add and you just click add and you can add those to your group. Now, by default, the person that creates the group is an admin. See, they have this little shield next to them. And then the people that are invited to the group are just members. If you want the members to also be able to add resources to the group, they also need to be created an ad, as an admin. To do that, whoever is the admin just clicks the gear next to their name. And instead of remove admin, it will say make admin. You can make everybody in your group an admin so everyone can share resources like that. Now to share resources to a group, I'm just going to go to my course. And from my course, I'm just going to hit the gear icon next to any of the resources that I want to share. Um, and then it's just going to say save to resources. I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to hit collection and I'm going to choose that group that I want to share those resources with. And then I'm just going to save a copy. So all that's going to do is just copy that. You can see this from resources to in group copy those resources over to my COVID-19 group so that um, anyone who else who is a member of that group can see those resources. I just wanted to remind you guys about that feature um, just because I know that we're transitioning everything to online and that can be really overwhelming. So groups and sharing resources in that way will be a way that you can um, kind of lighten the load for each of you because you can share um, resources that you've created. If you have any questions about Schoology, um, please feel free to reach out to me at msomerville at euclidschools.org. Um, stay healthy. Talk to you guys soon.